to meet future demand for fossil fuel independent vehicles. Volvo is working with several projects related to the pros and cons of alternative energy sources. Until now, researchers have had relatively broad knowledge of the battery cells and their properties through extensive testing at the laboratory level. One of the important unanswered questions is, however, how real-life usage outside the controlled laboratory environments will influence the life of the lithium-ion batteries. To be able to analyze the processes that affect the battery's health and longevity, Volvo has initiated a research program with the Royal Institute of Technology. With the combination of quantitative and qualitative data we get from the driver's use of the car, and the dynamic information we get from the fleet management system mounted in the car, we can determine the critical parameters and conditions for the batteries and learn more about how the batteries evolve in real life. The information we get will help a lot to design better batteries and battery management systems in the future that are more suited to the driver's needs as well as the best working conditions for the batteries. One of these factors is how the battery is affected by rapid charge and discharge processes. Other factors are the climatic conditions the car is used in, the battery's internal resistance and impedance, the cell's temperature and their peak power capacity. These may all reflect and affect the condition of the battery. Our research program has, among other things, resulted in that we already today know how to handle the tough cold climate challenges for the batteries. This is done by using an advanced climate system separating the car from the batteries. Furthermore, the research program offers the possibility of combining the soft side of driver behavior with a hard data from the battery and the car on a large scale. This gives a deeper understanding of how the electric car is used and how to adapt the infrastructure and technology to enable electric cars to be part of our everyday life.